But you end up washing them, throwing them like that, then you end up rinsing, rinsing all the soap out usually. Hey, Colin, how do you like being our model? <laughs> <laughs> I know, when just... I was, when I was younger, I asked my brother if I could make money doing that in New York. He looked out there and he said, no one respects models. <laughs> <laughs> You're not gay. Not at all. <laughs> You're going to have to get a little bag in you to say that for <laughs> So long as you're not showing any skin, right? Then your girlfriend's okay? She's okay. Okay. <laughs> I was taking videos of him picking the Cuba white grapes in the field so that people could see what it looks like to pick the, the grapes. And then when he bent over, his shirt came up. And I guess his girlfriend wasn't real happy. Because <laughs> I posted it on Facebook. Well, what kind of modeling is that? Yeah. He's got his clothes on. <laughs> <laughs> you guys are going to have to pick <laughs> I don't know what I'm dying to say. I hate to say it. <laughs> you know, we're from warm country. You're supposed to be on a tractor shirtless. <laughs> <laughs> My father has skin cancer taken off his ear every year, so uh. try to cover up as much as possible. Probably a good idea. Hey, back in the 70s, we had girls. My uncle had girls working the vineyards that would always work topless. That's a good idea. <laughs> we're, we're nine, ten years old, yeah. and my brother and I just run it all over the vineyard trying to, trying to see that. <laughs> Did you see anything there, Phil? Actually, with the host of girls, he didn't, there was nothing there anyway. <laughs> Mom! A bunch of boys. Little boys. Cool. All right. Well, once you fire this up, maybe we'll come back. Okay.